Hi, welcome back to Cranking Out Crafts. My name is Jay Flo, and today I'm going to show you how to make the double pinwheel with the new We Are Punchboard Pinwheel. Pinwheel Punchboard. So this is what we're going to use. I've already cut two pieces of paper, each six by six. And the punch board also comes with these fantastic instructions that you can follow. And it can make all different size pinwheels. And today we're going to make this, um, it actually comes to, let's see here. The, when we use the paper size six by six, it shows it's going to make a seven and a half inch pinwheel. But the reason I like to use six by six is because when I'm using a 12 by 12 piece of paper, I can get four single pinwheels out of it. So it really maximizes what you're using. Okay, so taking my first, we're going to call this paper A. And again, on this little worksheet right here, it'll show you how to make this double pinwheel. Okay, so this will be A, the ivory one. So we're going to punch up in this corner, line the paper up. Okay, so there's A. I'll set that one aside. Also going to remove the trash from the back. Now the red one will be B. Do the exact same thing. Okay, so I'll set that one aside. Now we will take A and line it up our paper size six by six inch. So line it up like this, fold this down, punch it, that pierces the center. Take this little part and put it in that groove and it slides. Twirl it around. It's okay if it doesn't measure up perfectly. We'll twirl this and twirl. Okay, so we're going to set A aside. Next, we're going to do B. So you'll notice that on this punch board, we have this side that is the B side. And I'll take my paper and line it up on this side. There's also instructions right here. <laughs> so line that up, push the board down, make sure you use this side guidelines now. Put the little piece in here and slide, twirl, slide, and then our last one. All right, we'll set the punch board aside. Now A will go on top of B, just like this. Okay, and then we will take part of our accessories that come in this well, pinwheel attachment kit, and there's several different parts. So I'm going to take the, I call it kind of a nail looking one, and I will put B in first because the B side needs to be in the bottom. And then we'll put A right on top. And there we go. All right, now it needs to be, when I'm looking at this, I have almost a perfect cross in front of me. Then I'm going to take the B side from the bottom, B side from the bottom, and push it in. Then I'll alternate bottom, this one, then the red. Now it took me a little while to figure this out, but if you follow my instructions <laughs> exactly and keep that B on the bottom, you can do this. That's very important. Okay, so you can see that pinwheel. Next, I'm going to take this part. This is where the straw goes in. This will go through the center. Push that in. It locks in. Then we'll put this little cap on top. And then the straw 
on the bottom. And then you have this fantastic pinwheel. So we hope you enjoyed today's pinwheel segments and have fun making lots of party favors.